1971, we had the big oil spill that started our organization. We had, there was about around 7,000 live birds picked up. And this was without even any search and collection. These were just ones that people found. So it was pretty massive. And the majority of them died. And what happened was when uh, Alice Berkner, our founder, and a few other people that got together to create IBRC, uh, when they got together, they started looking at the, any, any kind of information that was available to how birds were to be washed, and there was really not much. So I remember volunteering back then, and they had us put cornmeal on the birds, and we even actually put gasoline on them, and um, and uh, you know uh, the the kind of cleaner for grease cleaner and everything. None of it worked. It, um, it like I said, only three hundred of seven thousand birds survived. So it was pretty bad. So one of the things that happened right after that is Alice began looking at any kind of cleaning product that would clean the feathers off of birds. And um, she got some money from Chevron initially to do some research. And they just used feathers and bodies of dead birds and with oil on them to, to test. And what eventually she found was a solvent that um, used to remove it. The problem was it was really, um, f had a lot of fumes to it. We had to wear gas masks and it would, it would cut the oil off the feathers, but it was dangerous, it was explosive. The birds would faint with it because they would breathe the fumes. It was horrible. This was almost 40 years ago. And um, one day somebody said to her in the mid 80s that had she ever considered using a detergent, like a dishwashing detergent. And it was one of those epiphanies, she said, it never crossed her mind because they looked at every other thing to clean oil and no one ever said use a detergent. So she got all the different various detergents on the market and tested them all with feathers and, and bird bodies and things like that. And what she discovered is that Dawn detergent worked the best of all of them. There were a couple that came in fairly close, but the thing that she liked about it, and I always feel like I'm doing a Dawn commercial, which is really true, is that it cut the grease, just like it says on the label. It, it removed oil pretty quickly. It was harmless to the birds. They could swallow it. They could get a little bit in their eyes, and if, as long as it was flushed out, they were okay. Um, it was readily available anywhere. We can go to the farthest reaches of Alaska in, in their commissary on the North Slope and places like that and come back with Dawn. Um, and it was safe to people. So it met a lot of the criteria. And most importantly, it, it, it cleaned the feathers, uh, cleaned the oil off the feathers of the birds. And we were able to restore, the birds were able to restore their waterproofing, which really is just the feathers being clean and clean of petroleum products and then clean of the soap. And then they just naturally waterproof. So that's kind of how it came about. So it was around 1978 when Dawn detergent became the cleaning agent of choice. And to date, when we've tested all sorts of other products, this still works the best. And that's the reason we stick with it.